this is Liz with DC Digital and today I'm demonstrating our DC 30p play clock. So in this video I'm first going to go over how to use it and then I'll let you know what the hardware and some of the special features are. So this is a football timeout delay of game and play clock countdown timer and it comes with 25, 40, and 60 second timer options. So to use it you're going to turn on the play clock and the remote. The play clocks are already plugged in and on. So to turn on the remote, there's a power button right there. You'll just hit it once. The remote will beep to let you know that it's on. It'll flash green and it comes up with 25 seconds. So to start it, you'll hit the 25 button and the play clock will start counting down. So at the end of the 25 second countdown, there will be a three second end of period beep, or the display will show zero zero for three seconds. And then it will automatically switch over to showing 40 seconds. And the remote will let off a three second end of period beep. You can see that it's at 40 now. So all you have to do is hit the 40 and it'll start the 40 second play clock counter down. So the last option is going to be 60 seconds and at the end of the 40 second countdown it's going to come back up to show 40 seconds again just like it did with the 25 second countdown. So to get to 60 seconds and to stop this while you're in the middle of a countdown you'll press either the 60 button or the 25 or 40 button if you want to show 25 or 40 seconds and it'll pull up whatever second value you pressed you just press it again to start the countdown at the end of the 60 second countdown for timeouts it'll show the 25 second timer again instead of the 40. so let me explain the remote a little bit there's a belt clip on the back so you can attach it to your pocket or your pants. Um, the, remote, the radio that's being used is going to be a 900 megahertz radio. There's a 9 volt alkaline battery that's inside the remote and that should be replaced before the start of every game just to ensure that the remote doesn't lose power while it's in the middle of the game. Um, if the remote is low on power, it'll flash a red LED and it'll beep to let you know that the battery is low. Let me show you the end of second for the 60 second real quick. And you can see it pulls up the 25 second countdown instead of the 40. So the digit size is going to be 30 inches and those are red LEDs. The case is going to be 41 inches by 35 inches by about three and a half. It's made of powder coated aluminum extrusion. So to mount it, standard is going to be eye bolts um, if you don't get it on a cart. But you can also request C channel or 5 16 by one inch hex bolt. Then the power type is going to be standard. Um, for heavy duty deep cycle 12 volt lead acid battery. And those are rechargeable. Um, this customer wanted us to use 120, um, 120 volt AC plug. That's not standard, but you can always request it. And then the connections, there's gonna be a screw antenna on each of the remotes. There's gonna be a screw antenna on the case. Those are right here on the bottom right. And when you're attaching them, just make sure that they're screwed on all the way so that they communicate properly. If there's any dirt or debris or they're not screwed in entirely, they may not communicate well. So um, just be sure that everything's connected properly that way. And that is it for hardware and features. So all of our products are manufactured and assembled on location in Carlisle, Ohio. So if you like this product and want to order it, 
or if you just have any questions about how we can customize anything on our website for your specific pl needs, please contact us using the link in the description. So again, this has been Liz with DC Digital demonstrating a DC 30P play clock. Thank you.